Hi, this is Vidya Balan, finally on Facebook. Uh, I can't get over it actually, you know. <laughs> the moment is here. I've been very reluctant to be on social media forever. And then um, sometime last year, I decided to explore. Basically, I felt that, you know, I have nothing to say, all that I have to say, I say through my movies, you know, um, and I'm, I'm a bit private, I know that's difficult to believe because I, I talk a lot, but, um, so I was reluctant, but when I started exploring, I, I began to get a hang of it, but there's one problem I've always had since school. If they ask me for a short answer, I give a long answer. If they ask me for a long answer, I give an essay. And that was my biggest problem on the other platforms because I, I felt like, um, you know, I want to say so much more and um, I was having to cram my thoughts. So finally I said, you know, Facebook is the place for someone like me. I can say all that I want to without, with absolutely no restrictions. Um, so that's how I'm here. But it's... It's, um, and yeah, we went live at 4.30, but there was a sound problem, sorry about that. Actually, I, I never get into the first shot ever. <laughs> so that explains why we went off for a few seconds. But uh, I'm very excited to be here, to be sharing stuff about my work, about my life, with all of you, to interact with you, to make friends, as they say on Facebook. Um, yari dosti and all. <laughs> and what else? Uh, I have something very special because I wanted to make my Facebook launch special. I start this interaction with giving you a piece of myself uh, and that piece is called Kahani 2. Uh, I'm going to launch the very first poster of Kahani 2 right here, right now. And here it is. Can you see it? This is just a teaser of the things to come. I'm going to be going yakety yakety yak um, videos. You know, I'm going to write, I'm going to share everything about Kahani 2 and my other forthcoming films and everything that I do in between. And I don't do in between, maybe sometimes. But uh, as you can see, I'm really, really excited. And uh, I can't wait for you all to start writing into me. Questions coming in, so I'll tell you. Okay, so, there are questions coming in already. Yeah, Great. yeah. So Surve is asking, uh, when can she expect you to be in Ahmedabad? <laughs> Hi. Uh, I think I'm coming to Ahmedabad for the promotions of Kahani 2, else, so I will see you there. Um, I, I'm sure you'll get to know where I'm coming. I don't know as of now, but Milenge Zarur. <laughs> Shankar is saying you never visit Patna. Patna, I came last year. I came for an event uh, wherein they were raising money. Actually, it was a CSR activity of a, a very popular publication. They were raising money to build uh, toilets in 100 villages in Patna. So I was there last year, but it's uh, Ankita is asking if you are fine now since you are suffering from dengue. Oh God, of course. <laughs> it feels like another lifetime because I got back to work and once you're back at work, you know, you just forget that you had anything else. You have no time to indulge yourself. A, but thank you. A fan called Raj Longwood has a very funny demand. He's saying, can you show your hair from the back? Why? <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't show you my hair from the back. Why would you? Why? <laughs> Abhinav Ashish Banke is asking, are there any plans to come to London? Um... Not as of now, but hopefully soon. I'm ready to travel the world with Kahani too. So um, I hope the right people are listening. Arun Mukundan is asking, when are you going to do a Malayalam movie? Arun, you've not kept up, obviously. <laughs> I am doing a Malayalam film, a biopic on the poetess Kamla Das. It's called Army. I start shooting for it in December. Uh, so, yeah, so you will see me in a Malayalam film soon. Uh, 
I was asking you to tell us something more about the poster you just showed there. Uh, about the poster I just showed you, that is the first ever poster of Kahani 2. Um, and beyond that, I can't tell you, you wanted the one, you've <laughs> seen the wanted poster all over the city, I'm sure. Um, Durga Rani Singh is on the run. Uh, People, the police is obviously trying to track her down. Um, and if you have any information, please <laughs> let us know. I think she's, uh, she's, she looks a little like me, doesn't she? That's all I can tell you. The trailer is coming out tomorrow, so uh, please do watch the trailer and most importantly after that, watch the film. Sudha is asking, how was the experience of working with Sujoy again? It was mad. Uh, I think Shujoy and I bring out the best and the worst in each other. Hopefully after watching Kahani 2, you will agree that we bring out the best in each other, hopefully. But bring out the worst in each other anyway. We fight a lot, we scream and shout and I, I can't even believe we are like, like two uh, irritating children sometimes. <laughs> so Nali Kotecha is asking, when you act depending on the scene, if the scene is similar to what has happened in real life at some point, do you think about that time and act by how you reacted? I, I think when you're, you know, uh, when you're reading the script it, itself, if you've gone through something like that, it flashes through your mind. Sometimes it flashes through a little later, maybe when you're preparing for the role or maybe sometimes during the shoot. But, uh, and sometimes after you've done the scene, you're like, oh my God, doesn't this feel like a deja vu? I've gone through it. But uh, it's happened to me very rarely because obviously I'm doing films like <laughs> Kahani, Kahani 2, uh, you know, Dirty Picture and Ghan Chakkar and all that. And my life is far removed from any of those. Sakshi Sharma is saying that uh, she wishes to see you and Shahrukh together. So are there any plans of doing all uh, you know, a lot of people have said that and I, of course I'd love to um, do a nice relationship story with him but it's not come my way yet. Kodongi is asking, uh, what do you love the most about your character in Kahani 2? What do I love the most about my... You know, I've never played someone who's withdrawn and quiet and wants to be invisible and... Um, Durga Rani Singh is someone who's, she's almost like she's in a shell. So uh, I think that was a new experience for me because I'm someone who's very expressive, I'm very demonstrative, I like to talk, I, I laugh a lot. <laughs> uh, so I think it was, I enjoyed, I enjoyed being that person. I enjoyed the experience of those those uh, those silences, those very minimal reactions, I liked it. Hare Krishnan is asking, can you share some aspect of your life that you that nobody knows yet? I hate to comb my hair. So whoever asks me to show you the back of my hair, I'm going to slap you. <laughs> because I actually hate to comb my hair. Of course I do have my hair for shoots and, you know, when I'm stepping out for an appearance or whatever. But otherwise such an ordeal. <laughs> so Mith is asking who is your role model in the industry? In the industry I think undoubtedly Mr. Bachchan. I think his relentless passion, perseverance, politeness, all of that is so inspiring. Gulam is There's asking... Just one of him. Yeah. Gulam is asking if you are the one who will replace Rekha in future. I, 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 why should I replace her? She's still here. She's the most beautiful and there's just one of her. But I'm happy to be Vidya Balan for the rest of my life. People love the painting in the background. You want to tell you a little bit more about that? Oh, you know, this, uh, as a matter of fact, is uh, it came to me, there's a, there's a story behind how it came to me. There's this artist, uh, Shomitro, uh, Shomitruda, I call him, from uh, Delhi, uh, who used to be, you know, an art director in advertising, and I had met him through Pradeep Sarkar. Um, he he had an exhibition at the Lalit Kala Academy last year, and he sent me a brochure. So when I went through the brochure, I was like, Oh my God, this is gorgeous! Uh, but I saw 
you know, that there was a red, uh, red dot against the picture and that means that it was sold. So I didn't say anything. And then he told me, you know, I want to send you one of my paintings. So you select, tell me which one you like the most. And I actually said, the one that I like the most is gone, it's sold. And he turned around and said, oh, which one is it? And I said, it's Kali. Uh, firstly, I love the form of Kali. Such power, such sexuality, such such abandon, uh, the red, all of that. So, so I said, I love Kali. And he said, you know what? It's really strange, but um, when I was exhibiting my paintings, I put uh, the red dot on it to signify that it was sold when it wasn't actually sold because I just felt I, I needed to give it to someone special. And since you've asked for it, I'm sending it to you right now. So that's the story of this gorgeous Kali behind me. Tanmay Basak is asking, uh, he has heard that Kahani 2 is a prequel of Kahani, is that true? Tanmay, the tra uh, trailer is getting released tomorrow. <laughs> so log on and check it out. I'm not telling you anything. Actually, I, actually, I will I will not mislead you. I'm going to tell you the truth. It's a completely different story. Pranit Savant is asking, what is the secret of your smile? <laughs> Who's this Pranit? Yeah. Uh, Pranit, it's you asking me this question. <laughs> I, I, I don't know, yeah, I just like to smile and everything makes me smile and laugh. But thank you. Simar Bindra is saying she loved you and Akshay working in Hey Baby and Bhool Bulaya. Can she expect you to, both of you to work again? Simar Bindra, are you related to Venu Bindra? <laughs> She's just a friend of mine. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't get over my own <laughs> Sorry. Okay, um, what about Hey Baby? <laughs> Sorry. So, really liked uh, you and Akshay in Hey Baby and Bhul Bhulaya. So, are there any plans of working together? Uh, you really liked us, huh? Thank you. I can believe you liked Akshay and Hey Baby, but me, really, you don't have to be kind. <laughs> I thought I was crazy in Hey Baby. But, yeah, if there is a film that brings us together, why not? Kesha Patel is asking, what was the most challenging thing while shooting during Kahani 2? I think the heat, because for, we shot in Kalimpong, which was beautiful, lovely weather. And then we shot in, uh, you know, uh, we shot in Chandan Nagar, which, and another, we were living in another place called Kalyani, and the uh, temperature was 50 degrees, apparently. It's the hottest place in West Bengal. So I think the heat was the toughest, especially after Kalimpong. It was like, what just happened, you know? We just had such lovely weather and then, yeah, I think that was the toughest. So I shall be here for a long, long time. That's forever, maybe. <laughs> and I hope to uh, see you here often enough. I hope to, uh, what should I say, be friends for life. <laughs> Thank you.